here at 6 o'clock. A woman saved when a man tried to drag her toward the train tracks at an MBTA stop in Boston. WBZ's Beth Germano spoke to the victim and the person who jumped in to help her. I think I was there for the right reasons, honestly. Michael Hersey was there on the Orange Line platform at State Street Station when he saw this man, later taken into custody, suddenly grab an older woman. He kind of did one of these and then tried to like yank her like down towards the like looked like he was going towards the tracks. The 69-year-old victim left screaming on the platform, telling us she didn't know what would happen next and doesn't want to be identified. These guys. Suddenly, he just jumped on me. Everything happened so fast, and I was on the floor and screaming and yelling. Hersey says he sprang into action, pulling the man back and yelling to T employees who called transit police. Right away, I didn't even like think about it. I just grabbed him, got him off of her. But then he was saying something about a mask in America. Where, where do we live? The victim apparently targeted because of a reaction to the mask she was wearing. I was really, really, really scared. I, 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 my, hit, my right hip and my right shoulder is hurting. Hersey took this cell phone video when transit police came just in time as the man boarded a train. But it was held for police to take him out and take him into custody. The man was in there. They took him out, and he was kind of acting like he didn't know what was going on. I was afraid that he, maybe he was going to kick me and hit me in my head or something while I was in the floor. She received medical attention on the platform. Michael Hersey just glad the 33-year-old man did not get away. I was hoping he didn't get away because then he could have just went to the next train stop and did the same thing. In fact, Michael Hersey rarely takes the train, but on Wednesday his car was broken down and he had no choice. The suspect has been charged with assault and battery. At State Street Station, I'm Beth Germano, WBZ News.